we also understand there's politics going on here. He's appeasing to a, a, a liberal base for a primary. We understood that. And he can go back home now and say, I stood up to the NRA and I fought for you and that legislature overruled me. So all in all, it was just a, a motion for him to go back and do that. Um, you know, in the end, does that hurt him in the general election? Well, we'll find out. I mean, this passed, no debate today, the override. Wide margins before, wide margins today. I think it's a product of compromise and the governor should recognize that. I don't think there's a lot of, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull the fracking bill out. The governor's <laughs> office was very involved in the fracking bill. So it, it proves that they can do it. But you see so many other issues where the governor's not engaged. Where is he at on pensions? I mean, it doesn't matter if you're talking to Democrats or Republicans, you're gonna get a wide view on pension reform. But where's the governor at? He won't even come to a meeting that he set up. He needs to be in the mix, offering ideas, and that's how he becomes relevant. Uh, 